Okay guys, so you clearly saw us just tearing this case apart. Uh, partially, obviously, it's just out of curiosity, just because I've never seen one basically explode or tear itself apart the way that uh, this one had. So, first things first, obviously it's for a uh, BMW. One thing I did want to tell or explain, this transfer case setup is found in multiple car brands, not just BMW. I have seen it in other makes models. One particular that I do remember because I had to replace was actually a Maserati, which I was unaware, obviously, that they used the same setup. But when I got under there, I noticed that the uh, manufacturer, which is ATC, that's how you can look up uh, information about them, was stamped on that one and the module computer was actually the same which actually I did end up keeping and saving so there you go see Maserati it's the same deal and I was surprised when I saw that but um, reason why I have this and that one I'll explain but I kind of just wanted to do a quick how to of how these operate and work so you see that spline there, that's basically a shaft that the motor portion of this module will key into that keyway and it'll rotate and spin a worm gear, which is right there. And that gear will spin up against this guy here and if you can tell obviously this transfer case setup works off of it's not chained or anything obviously it's a clutch pack and then it'll tie there's a gear gear and gear this is what connects the output shaft let's call it for the front and so power comes in here through the transmission and this is directly out towards the rear transmission and once this is joined we'll drive the front wheels the way this gets applied is again that gear depending on how much torque transfer to the front the vehicle wants is how much it'll apply so if you Keep your eye on this portion. You can tell that it moves up and down as far as the clamping deal. So that's how it can vary the amount of percentage that it wants to send to the front. And obviously what came apart here, this is or was part of the cage for the the bearing that resides in here and sits up against the uh, other case so that's just a quick portion i just thought i'd show this aspect of it which is pretty cool and to visually see it it helps you understand and realistically this is no different than a transmission uh, clutch drum at this point and the discs and stuff in there I'm sure are replaceable if you want to service this or ever need the services before it gets to this point. And lastly, the reason why I have these is because you cannot simply install the used transfer case with the used module. It's almost like uh, installing a, a VIN locked module. So I believe there is a way to recode these or reprogram them, but uh, I mean, it's simple enough. If you've got your original one that has the vehicle's proper information to just unbolt this and transfer your original one over to the new used transfer case. And then you just run the basic reteaching, calibration, reset everything and everything works fine and dandy so again just hope you enjoyed a little bit of the uh tear down inspection of this 
implosion or explosion, whichever one you'd want to call it, and a little bit of uh, explanation on that. And so that's it. We'll get this over to the uh, junk pile for the scrap guys to pick up, and we'll move on to the next job.